Old Man Emu has been an integral part of the ARB family for over 30 years. Taken from the history of the Nitro Charger, coupled with our manufacturing capabilities whilst building the BP-51, we've now produced the MT-64. To learn more about the MT-64, I have with me here today Stuart Fuchs, Chief Engineer for the Old Man Emu Engineering Team. Stu, it's a hell of a shock you and the team have come up with. You must be pretty proud, hey? Yeah, another massive opportunity, really, to put out our learnings from Nitro Charger that we've been doing forever together with what we've learnt from BP51 and really come up with a, a nice product to fit in a sweet pocket between those two in the market. Yeah, I was just looking at the body, it almost looks the size of a BP51. Yeah, that, that BP51 gave us a great idea of how much space we had to fit a damper in there and we've used all that space again, got a 2.5 inch piston inside an aluminium body again, that provides us with lots of opportunities for tuning, for heat dissipation and really bring it a nice plush ride that people can enjoy every day. Yeah, right. And so who would this shock be for? Your daily driver that doesn't have lots of accessories and we've tuned it specifically for that. But it'll also suit the guys that are fully loaded up, with all the accessories and all the gear on and want to spend days, even months away in the car. That's the really big advantage of this shock. You can spend all day in the car just eating up the case. And something new that we've done on the front dampers of this MT64 is put grooves in the body. So what that lets us do is really tune that ride height into what customers want, but also tune the height depending on what accessories you've got fitted. So if a customer comes into ARB and, and buys an old man in the suspension system with the MT64 and they haven't put a bar on yet, what options have they got in the future with this strut you're just talking about? So we set that spring seat position on the strut by the accessories you've got fitted or by the ride height that customer wants. They might want a lower height, we can set that at a 20 mil lift we can set it at 40, 50 mil lift. When they come back and get the bar on, we can reposition that to suit the weight of the bar and get them back up to that 40, 50 mil again. Can you talk me a little bit through this shock and what it's made out of? We've taken a lot of the learnings from BP51's manufacturing and a lot of the, the technologies and, and materials that we use in BP and we've taken that through to the MT64. So things like the aluminium body, we really protect that using hard anodized finish. We've had to put in a second line in the factory to look after and facilitate the, the growth in this product. 6061 forged aluminium ends there that really give a robust, strong, dependable damper there. And inside that forged body cap, we're putting a really durable, double bonded rubber bush, gives great durability great noise and sound suppression for that everyday long touring, a two and a half inch piston, 63.5 millimetres. So that's a really massive piston. Really gives us that opportunity for tuning. These really big, long flexi shims that really give a nice rounded plush feeling. And that's what you feel every time you drive the car. I could talk about this stuff all day long. Let me go and show you how it works. Oh, I'm excited, let's go. What kind of upgrade is this on an OE shock that comes with the vehicle? Biggest thing we can do is sort of look at the way a customer uses a vehicle. We can segment the payload. As people accessorise vehicles, bull bars and winches and those kind of things, we're able to do, do new tunes. So being a, a suspension company embedded within a four-wheel drive accessory company, we try and get a, a tune done as soon as we get a vehicle before any of the other stuff like bull bars and roof racks and, and rear bars are developed. We can do a tune for markets where people don't want bull bars. People like the upgrade of the ride. That's particularly strong on this product. What one of our strengths is, is being able to segment that payload, offer two, three, maybe sometimes four leaf spring options, and then we tune dampers to suit. That might be two or three dampers that, you know, catering for the lightly loaded things right out to the stuff that's, you know, GVM upgrade and, and, and our GVM upgrades that are over and above OE axle capacities. The bonus for people that are overlanders or, or heavily loaded that we do a damper that really doesn't just do it, it does it really, really well. Um, it, it definitely feels like a really good all-rounder. Yeah, it does that, that whoopee section we just went through there really well. And what the MT64 is, is taking advantage of is that big piston and the big shims that we can put on top of it. And the way those shims lift off the piston to allow the oil flow really has a, a nice rounded, supple feel. And that's because we're just gently lifting the shim up and it's just really beautifully controlled there, really plush, soaking it all up that you could, you know, you could spend hours doing this. One of the other great things about having the big shim stack on a, on a nice big diameter piston is that we've got really good low speed bleed control, low speed crawling type stuff. There's not a lot of head toss. We're, we're controlling that lateral movement. That big shim on the big piston really allows us to optimize this. So we're sort of walking through this articulation here. With ease, really. With ease, yeah. yeah. Steering, braking, 
and, and traction to keep us moving is, is really good. So with the work that your ride control engineers have done, it's, it's really set to get bolt the things in and, and go and enjoy yourself, isn't it? Yeah, that's the bit of the engineering that we really love doing is the, is the tuning work. It is a bolt in set and forget. So like our other products, the MT64 has been built around a whole entire suspension system. You know, we obviously have multiple valving options, shock absorbers, springs, coils and leaf steering dampeners, bushes, upper control arms. So I'm assuming as well, uh, moving forward in the future, GVM is, is gonna be a part of that. Yeah, like all our other components, they go through the same really thorough engineering process to make sure they're, they're fit for purpose. And MT64 is no different in that regard, and it's definitely gonna be uh, applicable to GVM upgrades. Yeah, the Nitro Charger has a great name. BT51 has an amazing name in, in ride quality. So I suppose you've got a really good benchmark of where the 64 sits before it even hits the market. So the MT64 is really born of the old man EMU and ARB DNA. Reliable, durable, comfortable, safe, predictive and plush ride you can drive on all day without being fatigued. It's good for the passengers and it, it's good for the car as well. You're not banging into bump stops or topping it out. Well, thanks for the drive, Stu. That's uh, incredible what you and the team have managed to achieve there. Must be really happy. Yeah, thanks, Danny. Like all other old man EV shock absorbers, the MT64 carries the full three year unlimited kilometre warranty and also the support of our global network. For more information, you can jump on the ARB website or go visit your local dealer.